Hi, this is Brian from Optimum Feedback and I'm going to quickly show you how to install the Optimum Feedback Review Feed WordPress widget. Um, so there are a few things that you need um, in order to run the widget. First of all, you need a website that is running on WordPress. Um, we do have a um, HTML widget as well that uh, can be used on, words, on, on websites that uh, do not use WordPress, but uh, this particular video is for the WordPress widget. Um, you need the administrator username and password to the website and you need an account with optimumfeedback.com. So if you have all of these sorted, then you're ready to go and uh, I'll show you how to quickly install and set up the widget. So first of all, you need to go to your uh, WordPress um, admin area, uh, which is usually your uh, website URL slash WP dash admin. Uh, it will ask you to log on and then you'll see this screen which you're probably familiar with. Now what you need to do is click on plugins and add new. Here we will search for optimum review feed. And you should see this come up here. So all you need to do is click install now. It's going to take a few seconds for the uh, for the plugin to install and then once it's done and you see the activate button click the activate button so that's all done uh, now what you need to do is in your settings menu there's a new option called optimum review feed so first you need to go here and there are a few things here <coughs> Uh, that you uh, need to update in order to in order for the um, for the uh, widget to work. So here I've already got these uh, pre-filled, but uh, what you will see is uh, this field here is going to be empty. So um, what you need to do is log on to your uh, Optimum Feedback dashboard. Um, you should find that app.optimumfeedback.com, and whilst you're here, go into Admin and Settings. Now, if you click on API access, you need to generate an API token <coughs> for um, the Optimum Feedback platform and your WordPress to be able to communicate. So um, ignore these two, these are my existing API tokens, but um, what you need to do is just uh, name this token. Uh, you can name it whatever you want. Uh, we'll just call it review feed and click create token. And once you do this, you're going to have um, a line here with a random um, set of uh, numbers over here. So you need to copy this part here with the, with the random numbers. Um, just copy this one and this is the nu number that goes into this field here. So once you do this, um, you will be able to choose your location here. So if you have one location, then it's uh, then it's all nice and easy. If you have uh, more than one location set up in Optimum Feedback, then you can select the location here for which you want to display reviews on this particular site. So here we only have uh, one location set up. So we're going to se select this. And then there's a couple of other options uh, to select. So first of all, um, you can choose the minimum star rating for the reviews that you want to display on your website. So usually uh, it'd be either uh, either three or four, depending on uh, on your own preferences. So we'll say that we want to display only reviews that uh, are either four stars or higher. And here you can select how many of the most recent reviews you want to uh, display within the widget. Um, it's completely according to your preference, but uh, the, uh, the the default is set to ten, which we believe is uh, is is the most uh, most appropriate number of reviews to display, and that's about it. So you hit save changes, and you're good to go. So now the only other thing that you need to do is uh, wherever you want to display the widget on the site, uh, you have to add the optimum feedback short code is called. So let's just create a new post. And within the post, so this uh, this short code can go into any post, any page, um, anywhere on the on the site. So you can write 
anything and then within the post or the page you need to put square bracket optimum dash feedback and close the square brackets and this part here will trigger the review widget so you're going to show see this in a second we publish this post and now go on the actual site we're going to see the new post here and this is the review widget so these are the most recent 10 reviews for uh, for uh, the business that we have set up and here you can see that we also added this um, into the um, into the sidebar of the of the site as well so this you can uh, you can quite easily do uh, in the in the sidebar configuration but I'm uh, I'm not gonna talk too much about this and uh, that's about it and anytime you want to change anything you can head into settings option review feed and you can make any changes here if you if you want to change the location or you want to uh, switch the minimum star rating or anything just head here um, other than that if you have any issues with uh, the installation or setup let us know and we're going to be happy to help thanks very much